All right, so Kristen Visball, for those who don't know, she is the sculptor behind the fearless girl in front of the Wall Street bull market thingy. <laughs> so she is the little girl that is standing in front of the bull on Wall Street. So that sculpture was commissioned by a company called... Um, well, the company's called something else. I forget what it's called. But there's an ad agency called McCain. Or McCann, I think it is. McCann is the ad agency that basically wanted these sculptures. And they funded it, so forth and so forth. They have a parent company which funded it, but... Ad agency McCann, who is that's who she's in the lawsuit with. So there is a lawsuit against her, actually, because she took these sculptures that was funded by this company, so they have the rights to it. She took that sculpture and basically sold copies everywhere. And they are suing because they said that's their property, basically. They funded that, that belongs to them. She's the artist behind it and, you know, figured cash in on the, I guess, the momentum that that statue and the, um, the buzz that that statue had accumulated. So what's going on now is she is now selling NFTs to cover up her or to cover for her three million dollar legal bills that she has now occurred through this case. Um, she is the artist, but they are the people behind the funding. And so they are claiming that she has no right to go and reproduce this sculpture. So how is this going to work? Are they going to come to a happy medium? Is she just going to be out because this is belongs to them? Because it's an ad agency. That's their stuff. So let's see. We start with the Knight of Wands. So moving forward, there is some actions, some progressions. The Fool. The death card so there's a change a coming because here with the fool the food is the fool is something starting over and the death of course is change so um, not starting over but starting fresh so something is something new is about to come out of this um, that is going to help it move forward though so it's not a bad thing the will of fortune the eight of cups so they're going to be walk somebody's going to walk away there's going to be a huge change in goal here so whatever it was they were hoping for they're going to change course on that so there's going to be a change in the goal like we're no longer going after this we're going to go after that um three of swords so some sort of heartbreak and loss there because the will of fortune Speaks of fortunes and good luck, so there's some money loss. Queen of Swords, so it's probably for her. The Ace of Cups. The Three of Pentacles. So there's your ad agency there, and then there's the Page of Pentacles. So some sort of legal document, but it's worth money. Um, it could be the actual sculptures itself. Something is coming to an end with this. I don't think she fares very well in it, though. Um, but some sort of new thing. So they may not want restitution. They may not want money. They may just want the case to go away. Um, this is, I mean, she's racked up $3 million in legal bills. And so they can afford for this to go on forever. She can't. So there might need to be some sort of let's come to an end with this type of thing. And maybe that's what happens is that she pulls back because here at the eight of pent eight of cups 
Three of Swords, Queen of Swords, maybe she pulls away from this. Um, that's a shame. But, you know, it is what it is. But I think something, something's about to end. Something is about to come to an end with all of this. As I said, the Fool is a fresh start. The Death is a huge change, though. So whatever was happening has done a 360. Not, not a 180, but a 360. A complete change. So I guess we shall see.